Hey guys, and welcome back to another video. So I am just on my way out and this is gonna be episode three of Solo Diaries. So join me as I go into central London. It's my mum's birthday today. Um, so I wanted to get her something that she can enjoy for today because her actual birthday present is on the way. So I wanna to go to this donut shop. It's called Donatelier. So I think I'm going to get her two. I've seen one that's like, a, oh, it looks so good. It's like raspberry and pistachio. And I know that my mum would love that. Good. So I'm just at the train station. I'm literally it's probably so many probably hard to find me. Randomly in B and Q. I'm gonna buy this because I want to do a um, what's it called? I want to do my little DIY in my flat. So I'm just trying to look at different paints in B and Q. Right, this is the color I'm thinking, Tyrone. I feel like being in B and Q garden center is like peak adulting. Now, so. Weather. Your mum's gonna ask you to, to do something for her. As you can see, we're in Dunelm now. Um, I wanted to look at some lights that I want, but look at this lampshade. I think I might buy it. Cute, isn't it? Oh, I can't get that off. That's the other one. But I think I like this one. These are only £10. It's quite good. That one's £7. Good morning, guys. I have just woken up. I'm so tired. <laughs> anyway, um, I've got a few things that I need to do today indoors. So, um, yeah, I'm just going to get all of that sorted now. But I need to brush my teeth. <laughs> myself a lovely cup of tea do you guys remember this cup that i got from primark oh, so cute anyway um i've got quite a few things to do at home today like i said before i was just like figuring things out sorting things out you know there was just a lot of things all over the place so this is the lampshade that i got from dunelm do you know what let's go and put it up now why not i want to see what it looks like but yeah when i tell you dunelm if you are someone that is you know, upgrading your home, you know, with new decor or you've moved, anything like that, go to Dunnell because they not only have bargains, but like the stuff is actually really, really nice. And the quality of their stuff's really good too. Like I've got quite a few bits and bobs around my flat that are from Dunnell. So yeah, let's go and put this up now. Right, so as you can see, my current one <laughs> is bare wonky. <laughs> 
right, but how do you put it back in? It looks wonky. Guys, I was fully out here, ready to have a flipping heart attack, wondering why this thing's not working. So I decided to Google it because I was like, nah, I'm not stupid. Like, this doesn't make any sense. Anyway, I've Googled it now. I have a whole part missing to my flipping light. So that's even why the old lampshade didn't fit as well. Okay, I've somehow managed to make it look like it's a little bit straight. So maybe I don't need that other piece that's missing. I don't know. Also, quick update. So, you know, I was complaining about the fact that my shoes just looked disgusting. They were just all over the place. I bought these shoe boxes from TikTok shop. So, um, yeah, I bought, hold on. I bought 12. But that's quite good, isn't it? So yeah. My um, best friend has just asked me if I want to go to Portobello Road. Basically, we'd been saying for ages that we want to get the permanent jewellery. Um, and I mentioned it to her last week. And so she's messaged me saying, do you want to go today? And even though I did kind of want to just chill at home today, I'm going to not be a granny. And um, yeah, we're going to go and do that. Hopefully... The queue's not going to be a mad thing. Damn. <laughs> we shall see. Okay, so we're just on Portobello Road. Um, oh my gosh, look at those hats. I really like them. I want one. That's cute, isn't it? Okay, we're here now. What are you going to get? It's gold or silver? But now it's like I want gold. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Lovely, yeah. No product. Uh, super cute. So we just got our. A bracelet! We're very happy. Um, Melissa, I can't lie, I'm really hungry. <laughs> Food. I can see food. Alright, cool. Let's go. Oh my God. Mm. No. No. Eat pizza every day, man. Cocktails, baby. Okay, yeah, that one, and then I'll have a little bit of the spicy one. Anyway, watch the tap. Give me a Oh, wow. Thank you. There we go. It was £1.50. I was like, you need to buy that. He was like, no, I need it. I mean, no, just. Oh. Oh, uh, yeah. It's I think you should there. get it. Okay, I'll get it. Or even like those ones. Just, um. Oh. Influencer alert, influencer alert. So I'm just walking back to the car now. I just left my friend. But basically, after we finished at Portobello, we went to Victoria and we went and met her boyfriend and a couple of his friends and we watched the football and are you gonna let me cross yeah so we watched the football and then had a drink and i was just chilling with them but then i remembered it's sunday today and i really like being in my house quite early on a sunday because i like to just get home watch tv and just like wind down in preparation for like a new week or whatever so that is basically what I'm going to do. So I'm just walking to the car now. Honestly, guys, I had such a good day today. Like me and my friend were just saying that we need to do things like this more. Like it was so random and like spontaneous, but it was everything that we needed for today. And obviously like the weather was nice. It just seemed like everyone was just in a good mood. But yeah, I'm just gonna, oh, sorry. 
Is she allowed to drive down here? I swear it's the one way roads. My girl. Um. Yeah, I'm just gonna make my make my way home now. I don't think you lot understand how excited I am to have a cup of tea. Honestly, it's just all I think about. <laughs> I'm actually addicted, and like my auntie, she um she bought me us. She bought me some cream eggs, so I might have one of those, or I'll have some of my mum's birthday cake there's still some of that left uh what's the quickest way for me to go home this way yeah. but yeah what a lovely day out i just feel so good i don't know why oh, when it's like winter it's cold no one wants to go out no one wants to do anything it's dark that can have such a horrible effect on your um on your mental health and so the fact that the days are brighter basically all it means is that we're like one step closer to summer but it also means that like people will actually be more willing to leave their houses because it's such like like today was such decent weather i'm excited to be outside again so yeah i'm really looking forward to the next few months and doing more things in london like me and my friend was talking about this on the train we were basically saying that like obviously we grew up here well we grew up on like the outskirts of london so greater london but like we don't know london that well so we went portobello market i haven't been there since i was young and when i say young i mean like seven that's how long it's been so you know the fact that we were able to go today yeah ma'am vibes vibes upon vibes upon vibes anyway let me drive home now i'll speak to you lot when i get in hey guys i'm back home now as you can see i've taken off all my makeup i've done my bedtime skincare and it is half past eight i'm you know preparing anyway i'm just making a cup of tea i'm having an earl grey and i'll show you what i got <laughs> i bought some sunglasses from portobello Oof. i also have <laughs> some leftover cake from my mom's birthday guys when i tell you sorry i can just about keep my eyes open i'm so tired bloody hell anyway let me show you the glasses also before i left out i'd done my back in so it's been hurting i took ibuprofen and <laughs> when we got to the train station my friend she bought me this like free spray which obviously will help my back but like we couldn't do it on the platform so we just quickly ran into the toilets before the train came and she just sprayed up my back but I don't want to put it on now. I want to wait until I go to bed because then obviously it'll make it easier for me to fall asleep. But yeah, let me show you my sunglasses. So I know this looks bare weird, but bear with me. So look, you open it out. And as you can see, there's different color lenses. All right, this is the frame. Yeah. I'll show you the pink because this was my favourite. So what you do is you just clip the frame in like so. What's going on? Oh, there we go. And then obviously I've got all of these different colour frames. I've got green, yellow, blue, black, brown and pink. But when I tried these on, I was like, nah, are you seeing this? Hello? Hello? So yeah, that's the glasses that I got. I only tried on the pink and the blue, but I wanna just see the normal black brown. See, even these, these are nice, man. Yeah, I'm happy with this. So for the frame and obviously all of these different lenses cost me 25 pounds. I think it was supposed to be 30. And then he said that he'll do me a deal, but I'm really happy with that. Do we try the yellow? <laughs> The thing is, because I've got the fret, like, I can't tell what it looks like. Are these nice, guys? Leave a comment, let me know. <laughs> but anyway, um, yeah, that's what I bought. Um, and then, obviously, 
my little bracelet is so dainty and just so cute like so the woman said they normally can last for up to two years but melissa's already saying that she wants to go again next month and get another one this girl she's not ramping so um <laughs> we'll see but yeah i love it and i love my glasses so as you guys know obviously i've been re-watching uh csi so that's basically what i'm gonna do now i swear i just do the same things over and over again is that weird probably what have i done oh there we go all right <laughs> i'm gonna eat my leftover birthday cake from my mum's birthday yesterday and relax but yeah guys thanks for joining me for this vlog um Obviously, it was only solo diaries for one of the days. <laughs> but it was solo diaries nonetheless. That was really loud. You hear that? Car. Anyway, guys, I will catch you in the next video.